In this video, I want to go over the hashtag generator problem on Code Wars. And what it states is the marketing team is spending way too much time typing in hashtags. Let's help them with some of our own hashtag generator. Now, if we look at over here at the specifics, the string that we're going to return at the end must start with a hashtag. All words must have their first little letter capitalized. And any strings with lengths of greater than 140 or empty strings will be returned false at the end. Now, if we look at some of the examples, this will be the string that they pass to us as input. What they want us to do is to take every word in our string and capitalize the first letter, as you can see they did here. Remove white space and basically jumble the words together, as you can see. And then what we return at the end starts with a hashtag. If the string is empty or the resultant string that we're returning at the end is greater than 140 characters, we're going to return false. Now, the way we're going to solve this, we're going to start by taking care of all empty strings and strings with lengths greater than 140. So we're just going to say if not s or the length of s is greater than 140. What we're going to do is we're going to return false. So return false. If you didn't already know, Python has something in it called truthy and falsy values. By default, empty strings are considered falsy. So what this is basically saying is if the string is empty, or the length of the string is greater than 140, we're just going to return false. Now what we need to do is we need to capitalize the first letter of every word like they did here. And we can do this with a simple method called title. So we're just going to create a new variable called x and set it equal to s.title. Now we need to, we've capitalized the first letter of every word. We need to put these words together by removing the white space. And we can do this with method chaining. So once this s.title returns the string with the first letter of every word capitalized, we're then going to pass it to another function with method chaining called replace. And what we're going to replace is white space, and we're going to replace it with no space. And that's this function does exactly what, it's, what you think it does. It replaces all white space in the string or whatever you put here in the, as the first parameter to this. That's what it's going to do. Once we're done with this, um, we've done basically everything we need to do. We just need to return this string with the hashtag at the beginning of it. And we can do this with a format method. So we can say return s, or sorry, we can return the string. And we'll put this here. I'll explain what these are in a minute, but dot format. What we're going to format is a hashtag, and we're going to format x. So what this is basically doing is this format method is every one of these uh, curly brackets in this parenthesis will be replaced in this string with what we specify here. So the first uh, curly bracket will have the hashtag, and the second curly bracket will just have whatever x is basically the string with all first with all words first letter of every word capitalized jumbled together so this should work let's attempt it and yes all 50 test cases passed so that is the hashtag generator problem on code wars i hope that this video is valuable and you learned something if you did i would appreciate it if you liked commented and subscribed and i will see you guys in future tutorials